Hello everyone. Welcome back to the next session in CLD class. So, problem number fourteenth one. If sine inverse two a divided by one plus a square plus sine inverse two b divided by one plus b square is equal to two tan inverse x, then x is equal to here option a. A minus b divided by one plus a b. Option b, b divided by one plus a b. Option c, b divided by one minus a b. Option d, a plus b divided by one minus a b. So to solve this problem, we know the concept of properties of trigonometric functions. Sorry, properties of inverse of trigonometric functions. That is, two tan inverse x can be written as in the form of sine. That is, sine inverse of Sine inverse of 2x divided by 2x divided by 1 plus x square, and then the same two tan inverse can be written as in the form of cos also. That is cos inverse of 1 minus x square divided by 1 plus x square, and the same tan can be written as in the form of tan also. That is tan inverse of 2x divided by 2x divided by 1 minus x square 1 minus x square so here we use the first one result so 2 tan inverse x can be written as sin inverse of 2x divided by 1 plus x square so in that way what is sin inverse of 2a divided by 1 plus x square sin inverse of 2a divided by 1 plus x square is the divided of 2 tan inverse a 2 tan inverse a Because here a is there plus plus sine inverse of two b divided by one plus b square. Here instead of a we have a b. So only b is the thing. Now our result that we have got is the thing. Two tan inverse b is the value. Two tan inverse. And then in the right hand side we have two tan inverse x. So here take two as a common factor. Suppose If two is a common factor, then two into two into tan inverse a plus tan inverse b, that value is equal to two tan inverse x. So here two two are getting cancelled, and then this is of the form tan inverse a plus tan inverse b. What is the formula for tan inverse a plus tan inverse b? The formula for tan inverse a plus tan inverse b is tan inverse of tan inverse of a plus b divided by a plus b divided by one minus a into b. And in the right hand side we have a tan inverse x. So here tan inverse tan inverse are getting cancelled. So tan inverse tan inverse cancel out. Get it? Then the remaining value we are getting. x is equal to a plus b divided by 1 minus ab a plus b divided by 1 minus ab so fourth one is the right answer option d so idana solve madbeku antandre nimge ee property gottiru once again ee properties mele tumba problems kanna solve madtivi next fifteenth one the problem fifteenth one is appeared in your kcet examination three times So the, the problem is tan inverse of x by y minus tan inverse of x minus y divided by x plus y is option A pi by two, option B pi by three, option C pi by four, option D pi by four or R minus three by four, minus three pi divided by four. So if the problem na solve madbeku antandre tan inverse x minus tan inverse y formula use madta so once again it takes more time aa tara solve madta so adike ondu shortcut ta use madtira antandre nodi put x is equal to y is equal to 1 x is equal to y is equal to 1 x matte y ge 1 kodta idira so that result is equal to tan inverse of x ge 1 kodtira y ge 1 kodtira result enagirutte tan inverse of 1 Minus tan inverse of 
x के वन कोड़ते रहे y के वन कोड़ते रहे one minus y sorry one minus one zero zero by anything is zero tan inverse of zero is zero so here what is the value of tan inverse of one tan inverse of one is nothing but pi divided by four minus zero pi by four minus zero is nothing but pi by four so the answer is option c pi by four is the right answer so the na tan inverse of x minus tan inverse of y आप आमाद रहे उस मार्ग को इलान कर रहे ये दर्नाल में सिंपलीफाई मार्ग next step a solution of the equation tan inverse one plus x plus tan inverse one minus x is equal to pi by two is means in the problem in the sixteen problem we have to calculate the value of x here so value of x na calculate maru ko first suppose if option a is the right answer option a right answer agi the tan karana put x is equal to one put x is equal to one here tan inverse of x ke one substitute maru tera one plus one one plus one one plus one becomes tan inverse of two plus plus x ke one substitute maru tera one minus one one minus one is zero tan inverse of zero is zero so right hand side ke liye right hand side is equal to pi by two hote hai is it possible tan inverse of two is equal to pi by two aur jutta so this is not possible because tan inverse of pi by two is equal to infinity aur jutta so next step option b ko kya option b ko kya option b ko kya kya aur jutta hai toh once again one Minus one zero here tan inverse of first term is zero second term tan inverse of minus two tan inverse of minus two is nothing but minus two tan inverse x so is equal to pi by two under the other one so option B no put under the other one put the minus one put the next term put x is equal to zero if x is equal to zero then the value is tan inverse of one what is tan inverse of one Pi by two, pi by four. Next, we have a plus. So plus tan inverse of put x is equal to zero. So one minus zero becomes one. Tan inverse of one is nothing but pi divided by four. Pi by four plus pi by four. Pi by four plus pi by four is two pi by four. So two by four to two by four. Net value is equal to pi by two. Right hand side will be pi by two. So again. The right answer is option C. That is x is equal to zero. So इधर ना ना वो by the method of inspection method करेंगे. X के values करना अगर options करने questions करने कोटा हो गया अलग याव दो satisfy आ गए इतना नोट है. Next step. problem number seventeen पर. Before that problem number eighteen पर ना सालों का ना एक ऐसा तरह की properties में use मार देंगे. So here sign of tan inverse 1 minus x square divided by 2x plus cos inverse 1 minus x square divided by 1 plus x square is equal to so value ne calculate maar beko before that what is the result for cos inverse of 1 minus x square divided by 1 plus x square cos inverse of 1 minus x square divided by 1 plus x square is equal to so that value can be written as 2 tan inverse x 2 tan inverse x Similarly, here tan inverse of one minus x square divided by two x and the other. So then a reciprocal the latter. Reciprocal the latter because we don't know the result for tan inverse of one minus x square divided by two x. So reciprocal the latter. Tan inverse becomes in a given the cot inverse of cot inverse of two x divided by two x divided by one minus x. So the problem the property so this one can be written as cot inverse of 2x divided by 1 minus x square so cot inverse ni namge yavade tarada results kodila but we know the property that is sin inverse tan inverse x tan inverse x plus cot inverse x that value is equal to pi divided by 2 if we are in cot inverse x We want in terms of tan inverse x. 
So cot inverse x is equal to pi by 2 minus tan inverse x and the variable. So that result can be written as that result can be written as pi divided by 2 minus pi divided by 2 minus tan inverse of x. Instead of x, we have 2x divided by 1 minus x square. So here plus is there plus 2 tan inverse x. 2 tan inverse x. So so and then and then what is the result for sin inverse of 2x divided by 1 minus x square? Sin inverse, sorry, tan inverse of 2x divided by 1 minus x square becomes 2 tan inverse x. So this is also 2 tan inverse x. This is also 2 tan inverse x. So here minus is there, here plus is there. So these two are getting cancelled. The remaining thing is pi by 2. Sin pi by 2, sin 90. The value of sin 90 is equal to 1. So, what is the answer for the question? 1. 1 is in option B. So, option B is the right answer. If you have the same properties, then you can use But if you have the direct, then you can use the smart properties. Tan inverse of x can be written as cot inverse of 1 by x. Reciprocal the Next step. Cot inverse ke properties gothi rata. Tan inverse ke gothi rata. So we know that tan inverse x plus cot inverse x is equal to pi by 2. Then cot inverse x is equal to pi by 2 minus tan inverse x. So this is 2 tan inverse x. 2 tan inverse x. Both are getting cancelled. Pi by 2. Sin pi by 2 is nothing but Next question number seventeenth one. In seventeenth one, the value of cos inverse of cos pi pi by three plus sin inverse of sin pi 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 divided by three is option A zero, option B pi by two, option C two pi divided by three, option D. 10 pi divided by 3. So, it is right. So, now the problem is solved. First, what is the result for pi pi divided by 3? So, pi is nothing but 180. 180 divided by 3 is 60. So, 60 into 5, 6 into 5 becomes 380. If cos inverse cos are cancelled, the value of theta lies between 0 to pi. If sin inverse sin are cancelled, the value of theta lies between minus 90 to plus 90. So the question is that now simplify mark by by one So that pi pi divided by 3 can be written as 2 pi minus 5 divided by 3 is the color. Our result is like that. No? 2 pi 3 na LCM to cut 3 2 za 6 pi 6 pi minus pi 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 divided by 3 is so, pi pi divided by 3 can be written as 2 pi minus pi by 3. So, in terms of costly results in the Bhargada, cos inverse of cos 2 pi 360, 360 minus theta. So, this is 360 minus theta. 360 minus theta lies in fourth quadrant. In the fourth quadrant, cos is positive. So, 2 pi you have the function change again, right? result in a year there, cos pi by 3, cos pi by 3. So here, pi by 3 is the value, 180 divided by 3 into the 60 birth. So our cos inverse, cos inverse cancel out there. So first one we result to pi by 3 birth. Pi by 3. For cos inverse of cos pi pi divided by 3. Next step. For sin inverse of sin pi pi divided by 3, adunno kuda ide kara parikira. So 2 pi minus pi divided by 3 in the parikira. Next step, next step. Here plus is there, plus is there. Sin 360 minus theta, fourth quadrant. In fourth quadrant, sin trigonometric function is negative. So minus will there. Minus Pandirudrina, sin, sin of minus theta, minus theta. Sin inverse of minus theta, minus sin inverse theta. 
ಸೊ ಈ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಆಗ್ತಕ್ಕಂಥ ಏನಾಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ಮೈನಸ್ ಆಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಟೂ ಪೈ ಮೈನಸ್ ಫೈ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ನೈನ್ ಅಂತ ಬರ್ತಿರ್ತೀರಾ ಸೊ ಫೈ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಸೊ ಇಯರ್ ಫೈ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಫೈ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಗೆಟಿಂಗ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ಸಲ್ಡ್ ಸೊ ದ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಈಸ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಎ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಎ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಝೀರೋ ಇಸ್ ದ ರೈಟ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಅದೇ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಸಿಂಪ್ಲಿಫೈ ಮಾಡ್ಬೇಕಂದ್ರೆ ನೀವು ಫಂಕ್ಷನ್ಸ್ ಮತ್ತೆ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ಸಲ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀರಾ ಸೊ ಅದನ್ನ ನೀವು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ಸಲ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಅಂತಂದ್ರೆ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ಥೀಟಾ ಲೈಸ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ದ ರೇಂಜ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ ಫಂಕ್ಷನ್ ಆಗಿರ್ಬೇಕು ಸೊ ರೇಂಜ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ ಫಂಕ್ಷನ್ ಆಗಿರ್ಬೇಕು ಸೊ ಸಿಂಪ್ಲಿಫೈ ಮಾಡಿ ಈ ತರ ರಿಸಲ್ಟ್ ನ ಹೇಳ್ತೀರಾ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ನಂಬರ್ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಒನ್ ಇನ್ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಇಫ್ ಕಾಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಕಾಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ ವೈ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಕಾಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ ಝೆಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಬೈ ದೆನ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ವೈ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ವೈ ಝೆಡ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಝೆಡ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಈ ತರ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ಸ್ ನ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಸಾಲ್ವ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರೆ ಸೊ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ ಆಗಿ ಸೊ ಒನ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ರೈಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ತ್ರೀ ಬೈ ಇದೆ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ನಂಬರ್ ಆಫ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಎಷ್ಟಿರುತ್ತೆ ಒನ್ ಟೂ ತ್ರೀ ಇದೆ ಸೊ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಮಾಡ್ತೀರಾ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ತ್ರೀ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರೆ ತ್ರೀ 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 ಆರ್ ಗೆಟಿಂಗ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ಸಲ್ಡ್ ಸೊ ರಿಮೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಏನಾಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ಫೈವ್ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಈಚ್ ಒನ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಫೈವ್ ಸೊ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಇಫ್ ಕಾಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಫೈವ್ ದೆನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಆಪನ್ಸ್ ಇಫ್ ಕಾಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಫೈವ್ ದೆನ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಕಾಸ್ ಫೈವ್ ವಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ಕಾಸ್ ಫೈವ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ಸೊ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ಲಿ ವಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ವೈ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ವಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ಝೆಡ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ಸೊ ಇಯರ್ x is equal to y is equal to z is equal to minus 1 so ella one day thara value irutte substitute maadi results ke x antandre minus 1 y value minus 1 minus 1 into minus 1 plus 1 plus y is minus 1 z is minus 1 minus 1 into minus 1 plus 1 plus z is nothing but minus 1 x is minus 1 minus 1 into minus 1 so plus 1 1 plus 1 plus 1 so the total value is 3 agadre option yav right answer agirutte so option c is the right answer adike results enagirutte c 3 is the correct answer for the question number 91 next step next step for 20 a cos inverse root p plus cos inverse root 1 minus p plus cos inverse root 1 minus q is equal to 3 pi divided by 4 then the value of q is here p value back other calculate model q value back other calculate model now by using the same previous concept so in the right hand side we have a 3 pi divided by 4 so in the left hand side the number of terms are 1 2 3 so 3 pi divided by 4 i'm writing here 3 pi divided by 4 whole divided by 3 so here here 3 3 and 3 is in numerator so 3 is in denominator 3 3 getting cancelled so the remaining value is pi by 4 that means each one value should be equal to pi by 4 so here first one value is equal to pi by 4 second one value is equal to pi by 4 third one value is equal to pi by 4 so in the first one one we have a p second one also p third one q so q value we have to equate the third one so cos inverse of cos inverse of cos inverse of root root 1 minus q is equal to is equal to pi divided by 4 pi divided by 4 hence next cos inverse take cos inverse to the right hand side it becomes a trigonometric function that is cos what is the value for cos pi by 4 the value of cos pi by 4 is cos 45 that is 1 divided by root 2 in the left hand side we have a root 1 minus q so next step take squaring on both side to calculate q take squaring on both side here 1 minus q is equal to 1 divided by squaring on both side what the square and root are getting cancelled here square and root are getting cancelled so and then take q to the right hand side 
ಕ್ಯೂನ ರೈಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸೈಡ್ಗೆ ತಗೊಳ್ತೀರ ಸೊ ಕ್ಯೂ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಟು ದಿ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಒನ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಟು ವಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಒನ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಟು ಒನ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಟು ಬಿಕಮ್ಸ್ ಒನ್ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಟು ಸೊ ಕ್ಯೂ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಏನಾಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ಒನ್ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಟು ಆಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಡಿ ಇಸ್ ದ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಫಾರ್ ದಿ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಸಪೋಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ದ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ಪಿ ಇಸ್ ಪಿ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ನ ಕೇಳಿದಾಗ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಆದ್ರೂ ತಗೋಬಹುದು ನೀವು ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಒನ್ ಆದ್ರೂ ತಗೋಬಹುದು ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ತಗೊಳ್ತೀರ ಅಂತಂದ್ರೆ ಕಾಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ರೂಟ್ ಪಿ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಫೈವ್ ಬೈ ಫೋರ್ ಅಂತ ತಗೊಳ್ತೀರ ಕಾಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ರೂಟ್ ಪಿ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಫೈವ್ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಫೋರ್ ಅಂತ ತಗೊಳ್ತೀರ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಪ್ರೊಸೀಜರ್ ನ ಅಪ್ಲೈ ಮಾಡಿ ಸಿಂಪ್ಲಿಫೈ ಮಾಡ್ತೀರ ಸೊ ವಿ ಗೆಟ್ ದಿ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ಪಿ ಆಗಿ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಒನ್ ಸೊ ಇಯರ್ ಇಯರ್ That means each one is equal to pi divided by 3. Each one is equal to pi divided by 3. If tan inverse of x is equal to pi by 3, then x is equal to tan pi by 3. x is equal to tan pi by 3. Pi is nothing but 180. 180 divided by 3 is the red, 60. So what is the value for tan 60? Tan 60 ke value vera kirate root 3. So here x is equal to root 3, y is equal to root 3 and also z is equal to root 3. So by the method of inspection x is equal to y is equal to z is equal to root 3. Substitute the value for x, y, z and the expression that is 1 by x, y plus 1 by y, z plus 1 by z, x is equal to 1 divided by 1 divided by here x is root 3 y is also root 3 what is root 3 into root 3 root 3 into root 3 becomes root 3 whole square hence square root root are getting cancelled so 1 by 3 for the first term plus plus for the second one 1 divided by y is root 3 z is also root 3 root 3 into root 3 becomes 3 plus 1 divided by z is root 3, x is root 3, root 3 into root 3 becomes 3. So that value is equal to take 3 as LCM. In the numerator, 1 plus 1 plus 1 becomes 3. Here 3, 3 are getting cancelled. So the result is equal to 1. So the correct answer for the question is option B. 21 ge right answer yaudha option B that is one is the right answer. Now, same procedure na, use maadhe. So, it is not practice maadhe.